Hello, it's Rachel. Today is Saturday, so it's challenge day over on my Facebook group. If you want to know about that, there'll be a link in the video description. The theme for this week is drips and splatters. I'm working on some hot press watercolour paper, which I spritzed with some water before adding two different colours of Dilutions sprays. Next, I've taken a stamp by Darkroom Door. This is called Weathered Stripes, and I'm applying this using Archival Ink in the colour Vermilion. Next, I'm taking a stencil by Tim Holtz. This is a mini Harlequin pattern, and I'm going to use this with some Prima 3D gloss gel. This dries to a clear finish, and it's going to provide some texture to the piece while still being able to see the colours underneath it. I'm applying the texture gel using a silicone brush. To add some text to my piece, I've chosen a PEG stamp set from Studio G. I've stamped this out in advance just so I can visualise the placement before stamping it directly onto my piece using Versafine ink in Onyx Black. I'm taking a combination of some ferro paint by Viva and mixing it with some carbon black fluid acrylic from Golden and this is because I wanted the texture that you get from the ferro paint but I wanted the black colour. I'm going to put these through a stencil of drips and splatters, this particular one is from Eye Stencil. Once the texture paste has dried, I decide that I want to highlight some of the diamonds that were stenciled in the 3D gloss gel. So for this, I've chosen to use a charcoal pencil to just go around some of those and then I also outline the text with the same charcoal.
make my text stand out on the page I've chosen to outline it using a white Signo pen and after I've done this I go back to the stencil and the texture paste and add some more splatters towards the base of the card. That is everything for today, I hope you enjoyed watching, if you did I do appreciate it when you hit the like button or leave me a comment. If you are interested in joining in with the weekly challenges over on my Facebook group, the link for that is in the video description. There aren't many rules for the group, your piece needs to be 6x6 and follow the theme and that's just about it. Okay, I will see you again tomorrow. Mm -hmm.